Hey ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of WWE 13 Universe Mode. My name is Brendan, and we are one week out from Over the Limit, so let's get straight into the show. we got a few changes here today, so let's go and check it out. Now, we've added a new tag team, as you can see, Team Ziggy. So, Team Ziggy is somewhat of a stable, as you know, Big E Langston, Dolph Ziggler, and AJ Lee. So, we've added Big E Lang Langston to our roster, thanks to a request in the comments section in one of our videos. We've done that. We need a name for the team. I've got Team Ziggy for now. I think you guys can come up with better than that. So, let's, let's get a name for this stable tag team, whatever you want to call it. And, um, yeah, so let's get a cool name for them. And, um, yeah, so let's go and take a look at our contenders. We have John Cena's WWE Championship. CM Punk, Kane, Jericho, and The Miz are in contention now for the United States Championship. Cesaro, The Miz, Otunga, and R-Truth. Tag Team Championships, Hell No is, gonna, is the Tag Team Champions. 3 and B Luchadors, Primo and Epico, and the Primetime Players are coming after the championship. So... Good stuff here. Of course, we got to check out the Divas. We all love the Divas. Alicia Fox is the champion. AJ Lee. Kelly Kelly. I thought I got rid of her. No, well. Uh, <laughs> Beth Phoenix and Eve. I thought I got rid of all the old Divas. Oh, well. Who cares? It's a Diva. It's the Divas. Who gives a shit? Anyways, the match card today. We've got Natalia versus Beth Phoenix. It's Antonio Cesaro versus Zack Ryder. Santino Morella versus R True. So that's good. We have Cesaro. Um, we have Mirella and R Truth taking on each other. Those guys are in the whole United States Championship scene. Well, I think Zack Ryder might be in it too. I can't remember. I don't think I said his name. So Cesaro and Zack Ryder. And uh, we have Ziggler, Ryback, and Mysterio. That's a good match. And our main event is the number one contenders match for the WWE Championship Jericho Punk, The Miz. We're going to play that one. So let's go ahead and simulate. Natalia wins. Cesaro Zack Ryder, Cesaro wins, Morella Truth, Morella the United States Champion, champion wins, match 4, Ziggler Ryback Mysterio, Mysterio wins, well okay, and uh, yeah let's play, let's play the main event. Triple Threats, number one contender match for John Cena's WWE Championship, we will find out who will face Cena at Over the Limit. Which is uh, only a few episodes away, so I'm looking pretty. F I'm looking forward to that one. So we have a one more SmackDown to get through, and then that will be over the limit next. So here comes the best in the world, CM Punk. Well, it's certainly not the best in our universe, mode. He's without the WWE Championship at the moment, and um, he's, well, he's without the championship in the real life as well. But. But um, here is one guy that we are all really excited to see back in the WWE. That is Chris Jericho. And I'm excited to see him win this mate. So the Miz, he's uh, ranked four in contention. I think Kane is uh, ranked two or three. So it's just, I can, I guess it's a shame that we don't see Kane in this match as well, making a fatal four-way. I don't understand why since Kane being a tag team champion. I actually like the way that um, the game does that. If they've got a championship already, whether that be Intercontinental or Tag Team, they'll probably try and stick them away from the the uh, the other contention scene. So, you know, Kane, of course, is um, is in contention for the WWE Championship, but he's not getting an opportunity to, to take Cena on because, you know, he's a Tag Team Champion. So, whatever. I like that. I don't mind that. So... If there's anything you want to see in the universe mode, make sure you leave a comment down below. I'm always reading them all, always taking in your taking your suggestions into consideration. I know there's been a lot of comments saying, you know, change the team name to this, do this, do that. And if I think it's cool, if I think, you know, that'd be pretty cool to have my universe mode, I'll do it. You know, some outrageous things like uh, name, fuck, it, well, team up, team up, Cena and CM Punk or something like that. I'm not gonna do. Now. Of course, we're going to end the series at SummerSlam, which is we have, which is about two months away. So that's like 16 episodes or something. There's plenty of time. But what I need is who should we have return? We've got the legends that we can possibly have. What matches should we see? Now, with the legend matches, I'm assuming we're going to have to make them ourselves. So we can have Brock Lesnar versus The Rock. We can have Undertaker versus... Triple H. We can have Edge versus The Rock. We can have 
Shawn, I think we'll add Shawn Michaels into that Legends list as well. So we have Shawn Michaels versus Brock Lesnar. We can do all these different combinations, which I think would be pretty awesome. So make sure you let me let me know in the comments. You know what what match what matchups do you want to see for SummerSlam, and do you want to see them for Money in the Bank as well? We can probably fit one of them in. I'm sure there's a probably a crappy match that we can fill up there as well. So we'll see we'll see where we go. But I think. Um, I would like to incorporate the legends into the universe mode at least at least for one match if not more but yeah so for minimum one match um, I doubt we'll be able to get get a match going at at a pay-per-view so we're gonna have to probably do it ourselves but that's okay so we have CM Punk Chris Jericho and The Miz here now all, all guys have been going alright I mean The Miz has been actually doing quite well getting a lot of momentum CM Punk, of course, was the WWE Champion, but lost it at Extreme Rules to uh, John Cena, who, in actual fact, is my World Heavyweight Champion on my only, on my only universe, other universe mode, which is uh, GM mode. So he's uh, taking over my my shows. He's uh, the champion on all of them, so we can't get rid of him, just like we can't get rid of him in the real life, but that's for another, that's for another video, but... Yeah, so CM Punk's been out a bit of touch. Oh, wow. Chris Jericho now busted open from the Miz. Oh, big time DDT. Inverted DDT, I should say. Or maybe kind of a bulldog. Who knows? Punk going for the cover. Miz not having any of that. Chris Jericho, he's been up there in the contention. Had a few opportunities to go on and uh, get a shot at the championship, but just hasn't been able to, to clinch it, hasn't been able to nail it. Whereas the Miz, you know... We had him in the United States Championship scene, but he just became, I think, I don't know, too good or whatever. So I think I think I took him out. I'm not sure, but I'm pretty sure I did. But um, I'm losing track of everything that's going on. But, um, yeah, so The Miz, you know, he's been getting a lot of momentum, doing quite well. So he could be, he could have an opportunity. He could win this match. Who knows? He's like actually looking pretty good at the moment. Even though CM Punk doing some kind of a submission or, I don't know, move on him there. Followed up by a few drop kicks. Now Jericho going on the hunt. He would love to get another shot at the championship. I think if Jericho faced Cena, I think he'd win. No doubt about that. I think Jericho would get the win. Now, um, if you guys are going to complain that uh, you know you should make, um, you should play the matches. I will play any match that's not a championship match or a number one contenders match. Otherwise, that is bias. And that's not what we want in the universe mode. We want it to be unpredictable. If I play the match, basically, I'm going to win it. Let's face it. If I play it, I'll probably win. Now, we've had a few instances where I have lost. But more often than not, I'm probably going to win the match. So if I play CM Punk, well, then we can have CM Punk versus Cena at Over the Limit. Whereas if we have what we have right now, we could have Jericho. We could have Miz or we could have CM Punk. Who knows who's going to win? And uh, Jericho's got some kind of submission hold here. But Punk reversing... Jericho's done. He's got a lot of blood. He's got a brutal cut right to the head from, from the Miz who busted him open, open earlier. Now the Miz, a big clothesline to CM Punk. But I guess all it could take is uh, Jericho hits one code breaker or gets the walls of Jericho in and then bang. He's he's the number one contender for Cena's title. Who knows? Who's, who knows who's going to win? But um, it's a good match so far. Punk going after Miz here. Irish whip into the corner. Oh, now a shoulder right to the midsection. Jericho trying to get him some, but he's missing. Now Punk's going up top with the right hand, looking to. Oh, he's not gonna. He's not gonna do this. Oh wow, suplex off the top rope. Miz is. He's groggy, but he's okay now. But Jericho, he's uh, holding his head. He's got a busted open head. He's blood everywhere. He's he's not in good. He's not in good shape. I. Well, I'm, I was going to say I, I don't think Jericho would win, but I've said this many a time that this guy is not going to win. He ends up going, he ends up winning. So I've given up on that. Jericho, now that I've thought thought of that, he's probably going to win. And as you can see, he's going on the offense. So he's uh, building up for a win here. So, um, ladies and gentlemen, your new number one contender, Chris Jericho. Uh, with my luck and my predictability, I think it would happen. Now, the Miz has got a cover. Two, no, just a one count. Now Jericho, he's just kind of the third wheel. He's just kind of standing out and going, 
chilling while these two guys go at it. I didn't mean it like that, you dirty freaks. I didn't mean it like that. Uh, Jericho, now Irish whipping. Now with an elbow drive to the head. Go for a couple right in front of the Miz. I don't think that's going to quite work, Chris. You might want to throw the Miz out of the ring or put him down or something. <laughs> Maybe all that blood's rushed up to your, to your brain, man. Not making you think straight. Now CM Punk's busted open. Now Miz is uh, he's a bit brutal in this match. He's making everyone bleed. He's, I don't know where he's got the blades yet. It's two. Oh, ho, ho, ho. wow. Whoa, that was very close. Miz almost the number one contender for the WWE Championship. Wow, that was close. Holy crap, that was very close. Now Jericho, oh, they just ram into each other. CM Punk, he's thrown back in the ring. He's bloodied, he's battered, he's bruised. Jericho the same. The Miz, he's on top. But I, oh, I was going to say it again. Miz should win now, but he's probably not going to. Now that I've said that, it's probably going to be Jericho, I'd say, because he's just beat the shit out of. He's uh, beaten up, and normally when they're all beaten up, they pull something out of nowhere and they win. So that probably will happen right now. But um, these two kind of double teaming, just punching the living shit out of Chris Jericho. And now he's only standing tall in the ring. Miz wants to come back in the ring. So does CM Punk. Now Jericho, he goes, oh, I want to go outside the ring. Well, let's all join Jericho outside the ring. We'll have a party out here, shall we? Now Jericho, he's flown into the steel steps. He's down again. CM Punk's holding his rib cage. Oh, now he's just been thrown everywhere. Jericho's done. Oh, he's tripped over the steel steps. Fallen face first on the steel steps. He's going to happen again. Yeah. Woo. This is uh, this is exciting. Now Chris Jericho thrown to the table. Will he go to the announce table? The Miz is thinking about it. Oh, he's going to go off the top rope. Oh, he's not going to do this. Miz, you didn't learn that in wrestling school. Oh, my God. Straight through the, the table. Oh my goodness, Chris Jericho, now a kick to the head, these two double teaming Chris Jericho, come on boys, attack each other, surely, surely Chris Jericho will not go on over the limit, but he's making some kind of a fight back, now CM Punk ending that pretty quickly, throwing him back in the ring, now the Miz and CM Punk are refusing to even touch each other at the moment, I mean they just, want to, they want all Chris Jericho. Now, the Miz, he's behind, he's going to go for a side slam, he's side suplex, whatever you want to call it, he's done it, he's taunting to the fans that nobody, well, nobody cares about him, so, oh, oh my god, I picked it, code breaker out another way, what, oh, oh, I thought he was going to have that, oh my goodness, I thought he had that. And now a neck break. Oh my god, a code broker out of nowhere. If that had been, if he had a pin, him, I, I think I'd lose all hope. I would, I'd stop predicting the winner before the before the match ends. Now Punk with the cover. Yeah, well, I think, why computer? You've got a guy standing right. In, oh, skull crossing finale. Well, Miz, are you going to get Jericho out of the equation? No, you're not. You're going to pin him right in front of you. One, two. Oh, Jericho, I think you're just a tad late, my friend. Anyways, number one contender for Over the Limit, The Miz. I'm actually, well, I'm not actually surprised, but yeah, The Miz, John Cena, Over the Limit. Well, that could be interesting. Anyways, so that's the show. If you guys enjoyed Raw, make sure you leave a like. And if you enjoyed the video, well, there's plenty more coming because there's SmackDown coming real soon. And don't forget Over the Limit, just one week away. Uh, well, probably one week away, yeah, in uh, in real time as well. So, like I said, you know what to do. Leave a comment about anything I said in the video that I wanted you guys to respond to. Oh, yeah, Team Ziggy, who do you want? What do you want their, their name to be? Oh, wait a minute. Miz is uh, calling out somebody. I think he might be calling it. Oh, Ryback. Oh, Ryback. Plant down the Miz. Well... Feed Ryback some more. Well, where is Ryback in the picture? I thought he was in contention. Well, anyways, a good show tonight, guys. If you enjoyed it, yeah. But whatever. I'm out.